Hi, this is Raylene with Raylene Creates. Today, I am in my classic wellness planner for the week of December 16th through the 22nd. I have an exciting theme for this um, wellness planner and going to try something different. If you're interested in seeing what I do in my wellness planner with all these great sticker books, stay tuned. <music> December 16th to the 22nd, I am in a challenge um, on Instagram. There's a group that I am in called the Traveling Planners Christmas Challenge. Okay, we have a planner that's going around the country from one person to another and we're working on that. So you definitely want to stay tuned to my videos because when the pl traveling planner comes to me, I'm going to do a flip through as well as uh, decorate for two weeks before it goes on to someone else. So I'm really excited about that. And this group has been really amazing. We we kind of communicate. We stay in contact. We have a running chat. That uh, So uh, one of the ladies in the group said she had an idea about this challenge. So we're now having what we call the Traveling Planner Christmas Challenge. The theme is Royal Christmas. Now, it means something different to everyone. So for me, I just kind of thought Castle. Uh, I actually was seeing uh, movies that I could think of, Hallmark movies. So I got an idea that I want to try. I even kind of started it a little bit. And I hope you guys will hang with me uh, through this. Um, I um going to give it a try. Now, my wellness planner is a very important spot for me. And so I generally use it all the time, every day for um, my wellness planning. I want to make sure that even though I plan on covering this page, that I um keep it as functional as possible. I never ever use, no, I shouldn't say that. I don't use the exercise section much. So I probably will cover this up and probably put either, maybe put another thing. Because of my theme, this is going to be okay for me. I'm not going to stress about it. I actually love this particular section, so I'm not going to cover that up. I have some scrapbook paper and my idea was to use a castle. Okay, so I have printed off this castle, which will be the center. He's not the prettiest castle in the world, but it, um, you know, when I was looking for clip art to print, this was what I found. So I'm going to make this work. I wanted to go with the castle and I wanted to go with silver and blue. One of the things that I found out really, really, really quickly in the Happy Planner stickers, there is not a lot of silver stickers. And um, so I went through all the books that I have. Now, there might be books that others that I don't own and I was not going out to buy anything. So what I've gone is I've, I've went into colorful boxes and I've gotten some silver as much as I can. I mean, there's some more in there. I might go back and get some more depending upon what I need. And then in the wellness book, I believe it was in the wellness book or... um. Yes, in the wellness book, I grabbed uh, these words here because I thought that they would still kind of fit. So I'm going with a silver, a grayish, and, and a tannish kind of color scheme along with some black. Let's see how this works out. So I'm using my wax paper, which really kind of allowed me to go through as I'm finding, finding things. Now, while I was looking for things. I also wanted, with a castle, I wanted to do some Christmas trees and things. Now, inside of Squad Goals, there are these stickers here, okay? So, I'm going to incorporate them along with some presents as well as these. So, I definitely want to keep them there. I didn't take them off because I really wasn't sure until after I start getting going how I wanted to use it. And so, I'm just going to keep this to the side and come back to it. So, 
let's construct our page. So I'm gonna cut this paper down and I have a blue one as well. I'm gonna cut it down to fit and then I will be right back. So the goal is, is for <clears throat> this to be like a night sky, okay? And so um, originally when I started cutting this, I cut it exact. But because I want my castle in the middle, I really want the castle to be on the blue. Okay, so what I've done is I'm going to put this here, but I've also come and put these little strips here because I cut it too short. And so because it won't so much, I'm going to put this here and then this one goes here with this strip on the edge here. Okay. Okay. And then... I'm, again, Royal Christmas, nighttime uh, theme with it gradiating from a darker blue to a lighter blue. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut these and curve them and place them across the bottom. Okay. Um, we will see. We don't have to worry too much because the castle is going to be in the middle. So we're going to do this. So I'm going to go ahead and put this down. I'm going to use my Tombow mono adhesive and lay these down. Okay. So I have my first color down and then I'm going to come with these, but I remember I want to do like a gradient, like there's a heel or something here. And, and then I'm going to do the same thing on this side and, and the bottom part, I'm going to kind of leave white like it's snow. Okay. And I'll be right back. So I've cut these actually down the bottom. I tore it towards me so that it would give a ripped effect so that this bottom here would look like that was the snow of the bottom. Okay. And so I'm just going to go ahead and put some mono adhesive here and then put this here. I don't worry. I'm not worried so much about the center. I'm going to put this one here and then I'm going to do the same on this side here. And then I'm going to come right in the center and place my castle right there. And then I'm going to cut it right down the middle. Let me put that down. And once I cut this out, I'll then hold three hole punch, uh, hole punch again. I didn't want to punch it twice. So let's go ahead and try this. So my castle is down. Um, I'm wondering if I should have used white paper or a white sticker paper. So but. I've separated the pages and punched them. And honestly, I'm going to be honest with you. I do not like this. I wish I had done this on white. And I'm almost tempted to go and print it again. I was determined not to give up. Okay. The castle on clear paper did not work. So I went and I printed it on um um, white sticker paper and I like it a lot better. Determined not to give up because I really wanted to make this work for me. And, um, and again, I have seen that sometimes when I keep going, the project ends up being a lot better than I expected. So I am at this point now going to put in my, my trees and my bottom items, and then I'll come back and put my boxes in. I'm using the book Squad Goals. Uh, this book has a different different girls and seasons and things going on. And so I'm going to go into the winter section and they have these stickers here and these Christmas and these trees. And so I really wanted to add some trees to the scenery. And so I'm going to come and just kind of put some, some of these trees, the more of the realistic trees probably first. And I want to cover up that one more than anything. And I want to give the illusion of some depth. I wish I had more of them, but I don't. So I'm just going to try to do the best I can with what I have. And then I'm going to put one probably, I think I'm going to put a Christmas tree over on this side. To kind of connect to that corner over there and then I have another Christmas tree and I'm gonna put him on this side or it I should say okay and then I'm going to put another uh, some more Christmas trees over here um, probably right there and then 
another one either there or here okay, so i'm going to come back and i'm going to put some of these these um gifts at the bottom of the trees and so and then this area here on uh on the wellness planner these are are like focus boxes and i still have uh some some items that i want to put down for them and i will go from there now you'll notice that my lines are gone and so what i'm going to do is i'm going to um I believe, no, I was going to put some washi tape there to delineate my, my lines, but I think I'm going to come and use my, my boxes, my focus boxes. And this one here is going to be my gratitude. Um, so I'm going to put it right about here. And what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to lift up that tree and let it layer on top of it and put this between Saturday and Sunday. Um, and again, I'm trying to use the silver. As much as possible. And there's that tree. Okay. I like that already. I'm liking it. I don't know about a uh, royal Christmas thing, but it's a Christmas thing uh, nonetheless. Now, because I tend to always um, use my um, wellness planner for, uh, for positivity and all of those things, I'm going to come and add some of these things. On the weekend, I tend to, I, um, I always like to do my me time. And so I might, I'm gonna hold off on that for a second because I have these boxes here. I have this one here that kind of tells what today was. I wanna put that on Friday and kind of overlap there. I have a few of these and this will bring in another color other than the silver, okay? And then um, this one says be present. And so I'm gonna put that right here. Um, and then this one says dream big. And I think I'm going to go over here with this one. Okay. And um, I still have another one that of the darker ones. Um, and I can put those on there as well. I could put one here for today was. And now every, uh, I always track my steps. Uh, normally, I should say, I track my steps on here and I usually put a box for them. Again, this is, I'm on PTO. I'm not tracking my steps as much. Of course, my Apple Watch is tracking them. So I'm not really going to, you know, worry so much about it. Okay. So, and then this one, this box here, I, um, I think this one here is going to say, I want it's one of these to say note to self. There we go. Put that one there. And then now down here, the, each one of these boxes, I want to still be able to write in. And so uh, I might not be able to use all of these, but I'm going to use some of them. This one here says stay positive. Okay. And then here's my daily gratitude over here. I'm going to put that right there. This one says just breathe. So I might put, come and put this one over here by the tree. Okay. And then um, I really wanted to use these, but again, there wasn't enough room. Um, this one says to do and lazy day. So I probably might come and put that one here. Again, I was I was hoping for some stars, and so this is the closest I could get to some stars. And this I one says, get it done. Let's try that one. Right here by the tree. Now, inside of the botanicals book, I'm not really sure. Um, I found this one that says, you are a limited edition which I thought was really cute. You know, I'm always looking for something to motivate me. And then I need a box right here to cover this up. 
So I'm gonna go to the colorful boxes um, and see if I can find one. I decided to put some more silver boxes down here for each one of those to show where I can write. You know, you know, whatever I'm feeling on those particular days. And then I want a bigger silver box to cover up that exercise. So I'm going to cover up the exercise right here. And then use the words, do your best across the top. Okay. So, and then I'm going to come back with some more of these presents across the bottom here. Okay. I have some more here. Um, and let's put that one there. And then I was thinking about adding this to the bottom. I just love those things. And it kind of gives it more of that Christmas vibe. Okay. And then one more present to tie in that left side over there. I really wanted to fill in this section here to make it look like I have more trees here. So I'm thinking if I could come here the darker one is in the back and then bring this one here and then bring this one down here um just to give some more trees in that area i'm not sure if this pen will work but if this pen will work i could draw my stars yes i was looking for silver and so these will do what i needed to do and so it's just a little touch of something uh, since I couldn't find any silver stars in my in any of my books. This is my version of a royal Christmas. And um I I like it. It's okay. It's not my favorite. Um, but I want to try things. I want to put Put myself out there uh, I want a blue pen if I have one already and I my positive word for this week will be um, celebrate um, I put that word there uh, it kind of gives me um, you know, um, something positive to always think about and celebrate is a really good word. You're finding something to celebrate. I generally during the week will actually write down what I'm reading, what I'm listening to, who I'm feeling, what I'm watching and how I was kind of this week uh, towards the end of the week. And then um, here is I will um, if I have one main focus, if it's drink more water or if it's rest more, I usually put it here. So. This is my royal Christmas layout for the week of, of December 16th to the 22nd. I hope you enjoyed this video. I thank you for sticking around and bearing with me through the struggles. Um, I, I Again, I always want you to be able to see the realness of it. I'm very transparent in who I am. I'm not perfect. I don't claim to be perfect. And so I, you, you will see that I will show you my failures. I will show you the things that didn't work or did work and, and what I might not try ever again. And so that you will know that you can do anything. I, I know that as I'm teaching uh, this um, in person to a lot of people. They're looking for pa pages to be perfect and all these things. And I don't think that happens. So um, if I make any changes to this, watch my Instagram because after the fact, I will always try to make changes or whatever else. And you'll also see that after the pin on Instagram. So again, if you like this video, hit that like button. If you want to see more of my content, go ahead and subscribe. 
While you're at it, why don't you hit that notification bell so that you'll be notified the next time I upload a new video. And remember, as I encourage you, I encourage myself. Be blessed.